He is making Houston proud. Comedian Mo Ammer has always been very vocal about his journey as a Palestine refugee. And now he's able to put all of that into a lighthearted series for Netflix. This is Mo. Mo, hi. Assalamu alaikum. No, no, we don't have to do that. Yeah. Uh, great to see you. Yeah, right. Hey, you can keep your shoes on, Mo. No, that's gross. Oh. Well, come on in. It's really surreal. First ever narrative sitcom to be filmed in Houston. And now to be put out into the world, it's like, it's wild. I have goosebumps right now, Coco. We filmed everything here. That was like a big part of uh, pitching the show. Uh, it was like a deal breaker to me. If we can't film it here in Houston, it's not going to feel real. Uh, it's going to be inauthentic, and that's the last thing I wanted to do. I feel like it's an uh, extremely rare, unique, and beautiful story. What's your part? What do you play? I play his best friend, Nick. I'm a barber. I've never been to Palestine. I don't have citizenship there. I don't have citizenship here. I'm like a refugee free agent. I've been laughing through the pain and crying through the pain. Let me tell you something. We took our time with it. It was meticulous with every part of it, from the music to the landscape to the story. Mo says the idea to expand on his comedy came about after speaking with his good friend, comedian Dave Chappelle. And really, he was talking about my stand-up my stand special. And he was recommending I do a short film up top. And I never thought about a short film. I was like, whoa, that's crazy. And I just couldn't stop thinking about it. This show special is very relatable. It talks about experience, the immigrant experience, the refugee experience in a way that is, I'm not going to say fun because it is also, it's like a very deep show, but it's very funny. You should go to church with me someday. What is the Trinity though? Please explain it to me. Amen, el Padre, el Hijo, no, no, el Espíritu Santo. No, 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 he invited a couple of his H-Town friends to be a part of it, including artists Bun B, Toby Nwigwi, and Paul Wall. It's beautifully done, incredibly acted, and I can't wait for people to see it. And you have a little role in there. Huh? I do, I do. I have a little something. I don't want to give it away, okay. I don't, but uh, I was honored to be a part of it. Mo asked me to be a part. I'm so glad that I didn't mess it up. Oh uh, yeah, right. You enhanced the show. I didn't get a Quentin well, Tarantino really? slow motion <laughs> with the fire behind me walk in. We'll do that, man. Season two, bro. Season two, boom. Season two. There it is. This is Houston. How does this feel? To see the show, just <laughs> this is real. Like this is real. The sign is real. My brother is standing next to me. My brothers are here. My sisters here. Like this is amazing. I just love how he is representing Houston. Make sure you tune in on Netflix on August 24th. I'm Coco Dominguez reporting from the Deluxe Theater, Fox 26 News.